Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I am going to be reacting to KZ Tending and singing Close to You, which originally was done by the Car- well, not originally done by the Carpenters. It was originally a Dion Warwick song written by Burt Bacharach, covered by the Carpenters, and the Carpenters made it famous. And it's like one of their main signature songs. I am a huge Carpenters fan. They're probably the, la the last uh, group that people would assume that I liked, but I love them. I think Karen had a one in a million voice. I think if she were still here that oh, it would, oh, the music world would be completely different. I've actually been binging a lot of old interviews and documentaries on them. And I even rewatched um, the Karen Carpenter story, which was a made for TV movie. It's available on YouTube. Um, Richard actually had a had some say in, in the movie and I think in some of the scenes, but later he, uh, regretted being a part of it. And there were some, there were some timeline inconsistencies. There were some scenes that he says never happened. I'm not sure what scenes those were. And of course, because it was, you know, a made for TV movie, I'm assuming some of those things were dramatized, um, and were made to be more than what actually happened. So I would love to see, a Carpenter's like mini series, like on Netflix, how they're doing the Selena series, which I binged in like a day. Um, but I think Netflix or Amazon should make a uh, Carpenter's mini series because between Karen and Richard individually, not just as a, as a duo, but they individually had their own battles. And to just the Karen Carpenter story, while it is eye opening to and everything that she went through it didn't go deep enough i don't i don't feel and their career was just like rushed through like they they can they consolidated their entire career into like an hour and a half and that's that's not enough time that's why i appreciate the selena series because the movie did a really really good job and i it's one of the best biopics the series is is allowing the fans and new fans to even hone in on like what it was like for them when they were first starting out as kids. Cause they, they, they kind of gloss over it in the movie. Like, Oh yeah, they had hard times. Okay. And then they had that one hit and then boom, everything just exploded and was wonderful for them. But it wasn't, it wasn't just, you know, a few times. It was like years of them, you know, trying to, to, to make music a thing that they could, you know, live off of. So I, I would love to see a Carpenter's miniseries is all I'm trying to say. I am loving KZ tending in so far. And this was requested to me. I don't know if it was because I'm a Carpenter's fan or if they just think I, I'll like it. But either way, I'm excited because I am a huge Carpenter's fan. And I loved KZ. And I'm, I'm, I I I have no idea what she's going to do with it. I, I, I really don't. I've like tried to think, like, what could she possibly do to Close to You? Because... When she does a cover of a song, she takes it and like, usually, she usually will change the song arrangement or at least the style of the song. It changes at least two or three times. <laughs> so like, um, like say something started off kind of slow and then it went into this rock sound and then it, then it, it went back into this like hybrid arrangement. It was, it was the most bizarre cover, but it was so cool and interesting to hear so with this being you know a love song and everything I'm just I really have no idea what she's gonna do with it so I'm I'm really excited so let's just jump into this reaction I think I've I think I've talked long enough so let's just jump into it why do birds suddenly appear Every time you are near, just like me, I'm gonna cry. They long to be close to you. Why do stars fall? Decided to create a dream come true. 
minute to pause. I love getting to hear her lower tone and it sounds so pretty and I'm just going to take a second to appreciate. So she was being lowered and that thing came to like a pretty abrupt halt and she just kept singing. Like it didn't affect her voice. Like she didn't go Ugh, or do anything weird to indicate that that was a heavy impact, which it was. So she has like a lot of muscle control to be able to not be phased by that jolt of it, how it landed. It just, it landed so hard. And I love the blonde hair on her. She looks really pretty. wondering because in the in the disc in the title it says hidden talent and i'm like what could this hidden talent be because i already knew she could rap but i was like she's not gonna rap during a carpenter song so what is she gonna do i was not expecting her to be able to like play a trumpet okay so she was able to make herself sound like she was playing a trumpet with like a mute in it um a mute is something that they would like put in the the bell of the trumpet to give it kind of a, well, a muted sound like lower uh a lower sound and then they also have a thing where they can put it at the end of the trumpet usually on trombones but sometimes on trumpets too uh where they they would usually play with the left hand and then with the right hand they hold like something 
they they'll hold something over the horn and then kind of open it and close it really fast so it goes it gives like that wah 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 sound so she was able to do that with her mouth closed too so she's got this like ventriloquist talent also which is just not something i expected and i like that she didn't really do a whole lot with it as far as like changing the arrangement of the song or changing the tempo of the song she still made it her own without changing it too much to be something entirely different but that was really something interesting that was really special she's very interesting now knowing that she is basically also a ventriloquist trumpet player <laughs> are there other artists in the philippines or you know just in general that you might know of that have hidden talents like this because that was that was interesting and i I'd, I'd like to see more of that so if you have any of those videos that you'd like me to react to please leave them down in the comments i'm gonna call this video done so if you like these kinds of videos please hit the subscribe button don't forget to hit the notification bell to be notified when i have new videos coming out and i will see you guys in the next one bye